How do I access my work email? If you're working from home or need to check your work emails on the go, accessing your work email can be a bit tricky. But don't worry, we've got you covered. Let's break it down step by step. First, you need to contact your company's IT department. This is crucial because they will confirm if you are allowed to access your work email from outside the office. They will also provide you with the necessary email address and password, as well as any specific instructions or company policies you need to follow. Next, you need to determine if your company uses Office 365 or Microsoft Exchange Online. This will affect how you log in. If your company uses Office 365, you'll need to download the Office 365 suite, which includes Outlook. You can search for Office 365 online or ask your IT department for a download link. Once downloaded, open the Outlook application and enter your work email address and password. If you already have Outlook on your computer for other emails, you can simply add your work account. Click on File in the top left corner, then click on Add Account and enter your work email details. For those using Microsoft Exchange Online, your IT department will provide a specific URL for signing in. Save this URL as a bookmark and use your email address and password to log in. Now, let's talk about accessing your work email on your smartphone. The process is similar, but tailored for mobile devices. Again, start by contacting your IT department to ensure you're allowed to access your email from your phone. They will provide the necessary details. On an Android phone, go to the Settings app, click on Accounts, select Add Account, and choose Exchange or Office 365 for Business. Enter your work email address and password, read the permission information carefully, and then sync your email data. On an iPhone, open the Settings app, click on Mail, select Add Account, and choose Exchange. Enter your work email address and password, turn on the Mail toggle, and click Save. Some Exchange servers might require a passcode, so be prepared for that. If you prefer using the Outlook web app, you can log in through the web. For Office 365, visit portal.office.com, and for Exchange Server, go to your company's specific login page. Enter your email address and password, and you'll have access to your email inbox. Remember, it might take a few minutes for all your email data to populate in Outlook, whether you're using the desktop app or the web version. Once everything is set up, you'll be able to view your emails, calendar, contacts, and tasks easily. By following these steps, you'll be well on your way to staying connected and productive no matter where you are.